Hello everyone, welcome to this YouTube channel, myself Roslyn and in this video we will see how to send an email with attachments using Power Automate Flow. In this video we are going to see two different examples. One is to send an email with single attachment from SharePoint using Power Automate Flow. Another one is to send an email with the multiple attachments. So let's begin to create our flow to send an email with attachments from SharePoint using Power Automate Flow. The flow that we are going to create now supports for single attachment and also for multiple attachments. Log into the Power Automate using Microsoft credentials. Here we are going to create an automated cloud flow. Click on this create option and choose automated cloud flow here. Here we are going to trigger only when an item is created in the SharePoint list. So I am selecting this trigger. Enter the flow name and click on this create option. You can see the trigger has been added. Now we want to configure the SharePoint site address and the list name. In my case, I am going to use this Power Automate development site and my list name is employee documents which consists of the employee ID, employee name, employee designation and finally the attachments column. Now go back to the flow, configure the SharePoint site address and the list name. Now to get the attachments, I am going to initialize a variable which is of array data type. So select the initialize variable action and enter the variable name and choose the variable type as array. Select new step and add a delay action so that it reads all the attachment with the content inside it from the SharePoint list. So here I am going to pass the count as 1 and the unit as minute. Now select new step and search for get attachment action to get all the attachment from the SharePoint list. Now configure the SharePoint site address, list name and pass the ID from the dynamic content value. After getting all the attachment from the SharePoint list, we have to read the attachment content. So select new step and add get attachment content action and configure the SharePoint site address, list name and pass the dynamic ID value and in the file identifier you can see from the get attachment action we are getting the file identifier ID. So select this ID, it will automatically add apply to each control to look through all the items that are presented in the SharePoint list. Now add an action in the apply to each control and select append to array variable. From the name, select the initialized variable in the drop down and in the value section, pass the JSON code value for the name and the attachment content. From the dynamic content, select the display name and from the dynamic content, under get attachment content, there is attachment content option is presented. Click on it. Now click on the save option, add the JSON code in the value section and select new step and search for send an email action from the dynamic content pass the employee name email enter the subject and pass the body of the email now expand this show advanced option and in the attachment name and content choose switch to input as an entire array click on it and in the attachment section pass the initialized variable which has all the attachment files from the SharePoint list now click on the save option to save our flow now we will run our flow click on this test option choose manually click test it will trigger only when we create new list item in our SharePoint list so in my case I am going to add new item here in first case I am going to add the single attachment employee excel workbook and i am going to click on this save option now you can see our flow is running here you can see our flow ran successfully and it also sends an email in the outlook you can see we have received the email with the single attachment from the sharepoint list here you can see we have only one attachment for this particular item that we created and the attachment is also added here when we click on it, we can view the data presented inside the attachment. Now using the same flow, we will see how to add multiple attachments in the SharePoint list and send email with the multiple attachments. For that, I am going to I am going to open this flow in edit mode. Now click test, choose manually, no changes in it. Now we are going to create a new item with multiple attachments. Click 
the add attachments here i'm going to add this pdf text file excel file and also the ppt now click on the save button to save this item with here you can see the new item has been created with four different attachments now our flow is running you can see our flow ran successfully and it reads all the attachment content here and finally it sends an email to the to the employee name user email it retrieves all the attachments it sends mail with multiple attachments from the sharepoint list so when i click on this it reads the file content here and this is how to send an email with multiple attachments from the sharepoint list using power automate flow with this we came to the end of this video where we have learned how to send a single attachment from the sharepoint list using power automate flow and how to send multiple attachment from the sharepoint list using power automate flow i hope you like this video thanks for watching this video and these are the free video tutorials that are presented in our youtube channel please check it out and please do subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos thank you